Why a bottle yeah. clutch? Yep, why bottle clutch? It'll, it'll win it. Somebody cover the dude. Use the boom shot. Oh, <laughs> oh <crap. laughs> Did you see that? Oh, fuck off. Oh, I got all three for the boom. Oh, what? <laughs> G'day gamers, this is Wobot here, and this is a commentary of a game that, well, this is before I had the 1v1 against Mystic Blaze, and I was with my mate Badger and Gun Blazing Baz, and Baz finally got his microphone back. Oh man, it was so much fun, and uh, great, just, just good to have you back Baz, good to have you chatting, but I just thought I'd put this video up here to show you this dude here with the retro. Yep. Now, look, I don't do the best in this game, but the reason I put up this video is to show you I beat this guy a couple of times with an Asher. There's Baz going off the talk bow, but just let you know that uh, old, old mate Badger said he went up against this guy, New Zealand Killer X, whatever, with the retro, and he said he had a whole clan of retro users. So I just want to show you players that even a newbish player like me can beat these people with retros, and we're going to rule them out. When he told me the whole clan were using... Retros, they said that's not a clan, that's a religious movement, it, it's wrong, it, it's bad. So, this was all on Saturday night, guys, and the, the last couple of videos I put up there, you know, the 2v2 and the 1v1 with Mythic Blaze, mate, look, I'm just going to, just go stress it out, this, this game, 360, parting up, it's still better than new consoles. Yep, the new consoles have the Wayne Bang graphics, they have all that stuff, but the party chat's still not the same, because you can't have me having the microphone with my Astros put in. Let me laugh. I just beat him, by the way. There you go, pal. How good's your retro? Yeah, but your bot got me. That's what I mean, man. That's all you are, buddy. If you ever watch any of my videos, that's all you are as a person that uses retro. No skill whatsoever. No skill. Um, you're younger than me, you're probably fitter than me. I'm 39, bud, and I still kick your ass. I haven't played this game all week. Just want to rub that in there to him if he ever watches my videos. But going back to that, and I had so much fun on Saturday night. I made so many videos, and uh, look, the other video I put up with the 2v2 with Mythic Blaze, yes, it is long, yes, the sound isn't the best, but I put up there because, guys, it was a 2v2, oh my god, look at that Bernie just blown into it. It was a 2v2 with Baz, Mythic Blaze, oh my Badger, and look, it was great. It It is what my channel is all about. My channel is... A little bit about views, a little bit about getting a bit popular, but it's about trying to bring what happens online to people on YouTube, and that's what that, I, I'm going to force more and more to watch that video, the 2v2 video, because that's a group of four blokes, mutual respect, great gamers, great gamers, all of us, fantastic gamers, from all walks of life, all ages, just going, hey, let's just 2v2. Let's just do it, and, and mutual respect for each other, and having a laugh. Excuse the audio and stuff like that, look at the gameplay, and it was a lot of fun, guys. That that, that made my weekend, it really did. So, that's why I posted up that video, no holes barred, it went for 14 minutes. Yes, the audio wasn't the, bad, the best, because oh, my Badger has Turtle Beaches. He's still trying to work it out, there goes Wobot taking out that bot. Yeah, but what I'm trying to say is, guys, you know, regards what it is, it's raw, it's up there, and that's what... Happens on a Saturday night. Now, I did shockingly bad against Mythic Blaze, and that's because, yes, Killer Beast always says time your shots better. The 1v1s are very tense, they're extremely tense, and most of the people I 1v1 against I do enjoy. I don't care if I win or lose. The fact is, these guys are good sports, these guys are very humble, these, these games are extremely humble. And they underestimate their own ability. They say they don't, but they do in their own way. And look, it, it's an honor to play against them. It really is, gamers. It is an absolute honor. So I will post it up. I will not do double takes or whatever and make myself look good. I'll post it up and add music to it and just get out there because they get a bit of a buzz and they show me a bit of kudos and respect. And you know what? It was absolutely awesome. Mythic Blaze, awesome to play against you in, in several times. And, and, and awesome. You're a subscriber. I'm having a bit of fun. I don't care if I do well or bad. I, I, I don't, guys. I enjoy it. This is... This is a game where you play TDM, which is which is hardcore. And look, I'm going to put it out there, guys. Like I, I, I've been playing a lot of the new games on the consoles: Killzone, Shadow Four, Battlefield Four on both consoles. COD before I snapped it. Look at this fucking new. Yeah, there you go, pal. Where's your retro now? Oh, Benny's got a great ass. Anyway, this game, TDM, without a doubt, 
Uh, He's up there. He's up there with the best. Why? I'll tell you why, guy. Gamers, I'll tell you. Well, you should know yourself. It's skill, communication, hearing. You have to hear. You have to listen and, and map awareness and skill, active relay, bouncing around. He's got a retro. What do I do here? Blah, blah, blah. Where your weapon spawns are. You have to communicate with your team players. Like, before this game starts, they're bad. Where are you going to push? Now, the funny thing was, we pushed in certain different directions. But at least we communicated we're going somewhere on Academy. We're getting there, because I'm, I'm like, wow, this is Baz on the microphone. I haven't heard Baz in ages. Baz is freaking out here. Look at this guy go. Look, look at Baz go, man. He's freaking out. He's going hardcore. On your Baz. You're on your own. Look, look at this. He's, he's trying to get an education in the light, in Academy, and he's doing well. A uh, bit of lag there, a bit of lag there, Baz, but it doesn't matter. And look, retro charts. People with the retros, there is no skill, nothing to prove. Hammer Burst is better. Sword Off is better. I don't care what people say. There is a bit of skill with Sword Off. You got one shot. You fuck it up. Hello, you gotta bounce out there and get around. When you go up against people like New Zealand Killer Beasts and not upset of my gears players, use that sword off, you're a marked man. Use that retro, you got nothing to prove. So, look, it doesn't matter, sword off is more skill than retro. So, that's all I'm saying, guys. And look, it was a great weekend. Thank you, Baz. Oh, my Badger. Mythic Blaze. Yeah, just. For switching off the new consoles, going back to the Xbox 360, having the microphone working well, the Astros, oh, look, you know, people, you can get your Turtle Beaches. You can get your Tritons. I'm going to be absolutely blatantly honest with you. Yeah, fuck you and your retro, pal. There you go. I'll be absolutely honest with you. I've tried all sorts of headsets. All of them. The Tritons, this, that, and the other. And there are only two headsets that people should get. And one is strictly for PC. One is for all. And the one of them all, which I highly recommend, are Astros. Why? Because you get everything you need into that kit. You pay 240 bucks for the Astro A40. Yes, there's a lot of cords, but you get everything you need. You've got the mix amp. So if you want to record and do things like that on the 360, or even on the PC, Astro A40. You've got all the cables you need. The headsets fit perfectly on it. And plus, you can personalize your caps, which is either side. And because I've reached 70 subscribers and reached a milestone, I, milestone, I've personalized. Oh, yes, you use a retro. You're a beast. Oh, my God. You're a noob. But because I've used... Anyway, going back to that, I've gotten used to how you get onto the Astro website. And I've personalized... Personalized my speaker caps to the best. I can't wait till they get here. It'll be three or four weeks. When they do, wow, it's going to be sexy. Astray 40s all the way. If you're a PC gamer, Plantronics. They're about 350 bucks. I've tried them at the EB Expo twice. Use speed controlled. My God, they are, they're better than Astros, but they're only for PCs. They're 350 bucks. Only for PCs. With a PC, mind you, with a good sound card. So, that's it. Um, I just also want to point out to you gamers here, this game's fun whether you win or lose, unlike COD Ghost. The graphics on this map is better than COD Ghost. I'm just saying it out there. I haven't sent COD Ghost back to Infinity War with the stat disc, but I will. It's going to happen when I get around to it. Retro noob. And uh, so that's it, guys. And look, I had a lot of fun with Gears of War 3. This is one reason why I say never trade in your 360. Never do, because... The one thing the 360 has over the new consoles, both PS4 and the Xbox One, is fun factor. There's a lot of fun with the Xbox Live. It is brilliant. Just, I, I can't stress even more, guys. Just tonight, the three, four hours I have with the conversation, you see it. You'll see the videos I posted up the last couple of nights. I've had more fun with this than anything else because it makes it personal. You're talking to people. It makes it all fun. It is what made the 360. It is a great experience. I mean, I'm playing against people all over the world. Sorry, noobs all across the globe. And chatting and having a laugh. And oh my Badger, Blaze, Baz. Guys, you made my Saturday night. You made my weekend. And it's fantastic. Look at these boom shop missing. I want to come. Bernie had her eyes crossed. Oh, what a bad shot. Oh my god, no wonder I lost again. I lost against the players. I did, I did. Um, I made Badger did point out, as you heard in the audio, if you did watch the full 2v2 video, I did get better when I was drinking, so maybe I should drink. Maybe I should say, send a message to Grey Goose Bogger. Hey, uh, guys, sponsor me. Instead of Red Bull, sponsor me. Sponsor me all the way. Sponsor me. That's it. That's all I ask for sponsor. So, all I can say is, guys, 
keep your 360, keep Gears of War. It is, in my view, the ultimate TDM. It, it really is, because it's a lot of fun, and yeah, a bit of bullshit factor, but it really shows you good sports and non-good sports. And a couple of people I played against here are good. I had a really enjoyable experience throughout playing Gears of War 3 Saturday night, and I've got heaps of clips to come up, as I promised. Uh, so my future comments here will be showing you a bit more of War, Warframe or whatever it's called on the PS4, a couple of new games here. I've got heaps of clips to show of footage. And Frag and Tag, keep it positive. Tell me what you think, where you want to go. Good to have you back, Baz. Obzens, please get your Elgato. Let's keep it positive. New Zealand Killer Beast. I'm